Hi. In this video, we are going to solve a hard SQL problem. So let's begin. Okay, first we need to head to sqlpractic.com. This is the website. The link is going to be in the description. Then we need to select hospital.db because we are working with hospital data. Then we click on view all questions. We select difficulty hard. And after that, we select the third one, which says show patient ID, first name, last name, and attending doctor's specialty. So we select that one and we get rid of this. And now we can begin uh, trying to solve this problem. Okay, so first of all, we need to uh, read the question. So it says show patient ID, first name, last name, and attending doctor's specialty and you show only the patients who has a diagnosis as epilepsy and the doctor's first name is Lisa. Check patients, admissions and doctor's tables for, re for required information. So let's see the, the tables. So here we have the patients table which has information about patients and their names, their gender, their height and weight then we have a, an admissions table where we have information about the admissions for every patient when they attended the, the hospital, what the diagnosis was, uh, who was their doctor. And then we have a doctor's table with information about the doctors, their name and, the special, and their specialty. Then we have an expected output. So this is the output we should get from our query. So, so you only two rows. And if we click on get hint, we can see some keywords we can use to solve this problem. And if we click on get hint again, we can see a portion of the solution so that we can have an idea on how to solve this problem. Okay, so now I encourage you to solve this problem uh, by your own. And if you want to compare the results or if you uh, don't get the correct solution, we can do it together. Okay, so let's do it together now. Okay, so first and most importantly, we need to understand the question. So I'm going to read the question one more time. Let's try to understand it and let's break it down and do it step by step. So it says, show patient ID, first name, last name, and attending, and attending doctor's specialty. Okay, so let's begin by doing that. Let's select. Okay, so we know we have a patient ID from the patient's table. Also, we are going to select first name, last name, and the attending doctor's specialty. Uh, we don't have that, infor that information in the patient's table, but we have it in the doctor's table. So here I'm going to specify from which table, from the doctor's table, select specialty, and for the patient ID in these other two columns. Because we have patient ID in multiple columns and first name and last name in multiple columns as well. And we want to show only these columns from the patient's table. So I'm going to specify patients, patients, in patients dot and then then and then the name of the column then i will specify from patients and since since we are trying to pull a column from another table we need to join so we are joining the doctor's table with the patient's table 
but as we can see there are no matching columns so in the patient table we have patient id as a primary column and province id as a foreign um, key and in the doctor's table we only have the doctor id as a primary key and we don't have anything re that relates these two tables so for that we have the admissions table which functions as a <clears throat> middleman or a middle table which connects both both tables the doctor's table and the patient's table how by the attending doctor id is the foreign key uh, which relates to the doctor id in the doctor's table and the patient id which is also the a foreign key relates or references the patient id in the patient's table so first we are going to join admissions and let's just let's uh, just give it a an alias id on then we are going to connect it with the patient's table and also let's give patient's table an alias pa and then we can just write the alias here instead of the full table name on pa dot patient id equals add admissions dot patient id okay so that's the the column in common then we need to join also the doctor's table doctors let's keep it an alias doc and or doc and here we can remove some letters and just leave doc so that we know that it's the doctor's table and let's say on doc dot doctor id equals add for admissions dot attending doctor id and then it says show only the patient who has a diagnosis as epilepsy okay so let's do that where and the diagnosis is in the admissions table so admissions table dot diagnosis equals epilepsy okay so we only want to show those have this diagnosis and the doctor's first name is lisa okay so first name it's in the doctor's table and doc dot first name equals lisa then it says check patients and okay so i think that's everything if we close this uh, sql code and run it we should get our result okay so we got it correctly so just to make a brief uh, resume so we selected these columns from the patient's table and the to grab this specialty we had to combine or join uh, multiple tables the page we had to connect the patient's table with the admissions table sorry with the doctor's table and by doing that we had to use a common key found in the admissions table and then we had to uh, only filter by those patients who had epilepsy as their diagnosis and whose attending doctor name was or is uh, is lisa so that gave us only two rows this patient um, had uh, epilepsy as the diagnosis and the uh, doctor name was was lisa and yeah so we had these two people with these criterias so 
that's it for this video. If you find it uh, useful, don't forget to leave a comment and I'll see you in the next video.